Today we're going to be testing the Max Tracker OTM 900 satellite meter on Hispasat 30 West. As you can see here, I've got about a 30 inch dish, a universal orbital tracker LNB. And I'm basically going to begin my scan now for the satellite. And I want to show you the functionality of the meter, how simple it is. Uh, you do have the option of turning the volume on and off for the alarm, proximity alarm. I'm going to go ahead and turn that on that down for two seconds you can see there it's in search mode you can see the screen is actually saying it's, it's searching it's giving you the satellite uh, name and it says UV for universal LMB which is the type I have you have the option of picking a standard LMB uh, as well and a C-band LMB as well uh, it gives you the, the, the satellite uh, location 30 West which is Hispasat and I'm gonna go ahead and begin my uh, my search for the dish and you're gonna see the uh, signal bar how it's going to respond. Uh, it's going to go from uh, medium to high and then once it finds a satellite it's going to indicate found and then actually you'll get another bar that will appear which is the quality bar. And all you basically got to do there is peek out the quality bar and you're done with your, your satellite installation. So let, let's begin. Uh, I'm going to basically uh, start scanning the dish from left to right. I know more or less ballpark where it's going to be. I just want to give you a good close-up of the meter as I'm turning the dish. And you can see here, I'm, I'm actually turning the dish. You can see my hand. I'm actually pulling the dish. You'll see here how it's going to be. It's all right about here. You see there? I found it, and I picked it out. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it off alignment, and I want you to see my hand here. I'm, I'm just barely going to touch the dish so you can see how sensitive this unit is. See that? Go ahead and pull it over. See there? I'm barely on it, and I basically just adjusted it there. And that's basically it. Uh, you go to uh, the Max Peak website, you download the satellite files you want for the unit. You download them to your unit, could hold up to 20, about 20 satellites in its memory. Uh, once you do that, um, basically start doing your search.